it's Erica and welcome to today's video. I am reviewing another ColourPop palette and this one is the Double Entendra, and Entendra. I'm not really sure how to pronounce that. Um, but I am going to be reviewing this, swatching this, and tutorialing this. I'm going to be doing a tutorial with it. <laughs> Whatever. Um, so I just picked this up over the holiday, um, Black Friday, Cyber Monday. So I am really excited. The thing that threw me off, though, is that this palette looks exactly like this palette from ColourPop. And I thought I was, like, duped. I, like, the packaging, like, on the outside, like, the box, that was different. But I thought the actual palette was different. So when I look at the back, this is the I Think I Love You palette. They have the different, um, like, sticker on the back. And the colors are both different. Um, so they are different palettes. It's just they're in the same outside packaging. Does that make sense? Um, it's very... It's very deceiving, I think, but I did email ColourPop and I asked them if I was, like, duped or something or if this was a mistake, and they said it wasn't, that's how the palette comes, so I don't really know. But I also purchased the Cute AF ColourPop palette by, or, um, and this is the Yes Please palette. Looks like this. And I picked that up with this palette, but I'm doing the review on this palette right here. So I thought this was more of a nude palette, and it's actually more of like the Tarte, the Tartlet Heat palette, or the Urban Decay, no, the yeah. Tartlet Toasted palette, or the Urban Decay Heat, Heat palette. It's kind of like that, where you get the more, um bronzy kind of colors, the more fall colors, warm tone colors, uh, those things, and that is not what I was expecting. I was thinking, um, neutral, and, yeah, but I really do like this. This, I mean, if you can't afford, like, I can't afford right now the, or I, okay, I shouldn't say I can't afford it, but, like, I don't want to splurge on the Tartlet Toasted right now or the Urban Decay Heat Palette right now because they are on the more expensive end. So this was $16 and right now they're running a 30% off, 20% off palette so it would be $12.80 right now. So um, this is like so much more inexpensive and I think it works, it works really well for the price. Like it looks amazing okay like it looks amazing so I think if you want to get something that's similar to the Urban Decay Heat or the Tartlet Toasted and you don't want to spend a whole lot on it this would definitely be your best option um, in my opinion so you'd get the same size palette as all of the other palettes that um, ColourPop has you get the 12 shades in here that have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight matte shadows and four like duochrome metallic type of shades in here. And I honestly like all of ColourPop's palettes that I own. Um, I think I own like half of the palettes that they have come out with, maybe a little more than half, but. I am very satisfied with every single palette that I have gotten, and this is nothing less than what I expected um, other than the colors, because online, to me, it looks more nude than it does, like, brownie orangish colors, but I recommend this if you don't want to splurge on the higher-end palettes that are similar to this, because this is definitely a good dupe. If you guys want to see a dupe video between the this ColourPop palette and one of the Naked, the, between the Naked Heat or the Tartlet Toasted, whichever one of those, if you want to see a dupe video, let me know in the comments, and I will go purchase that to do a video for you if that's what you would like to see. And yeah, 
Alright guys, so I hope that you enjoyed that tutorial and the swatches of this palette. And if you did, please give it a big thumbs up. Hit that red subscribe button on your screen somewhere. Don't forget to hit that bell to get notified of more videos coming your way on my channel. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye! Bye! You say bye? <laughs>